Hey guys, it's K7. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up the CMU emulator and get it running with keys included plus one bonus game. You can see all the links that you need to download in the description below. Everything is going to be there. But right now I'm going to be showing you guys how to set this up and get it running for your first time users or those of you who haven't used simulator the emulator in a long time and just want to refresh so let's get started the first thing you're going to want to do is go over to the emulator website as you can see here so you're going to download the latest version of the CMU emulator once you download it you can put it on the desktop or whatever it doesn't matter where you put it just move it somewhere and then hit the extract button as you can see here so right click on it and then hit extract once you extract the folder you'll get some files in here as you can see you can see you got you got some files plus the Citra emulator you want to click and start up the Citra emulator at least once while you're while you're in the Citra emulator you might as well set up your controls so you're going to click over to options input settings and then put whatever controller that you're using plus whatever gamepad preferably you'd like to use with your Wii U emulator or CMU emulator once you've done that you can close it out and if you take a look in the folder you see there's some extra files you can see there's two files here but the one we're interested in is the keys this is the place where you will be placing the game title keys for when you want to play a CMU emulator game some of these need keys like WUD files and the other file types usually don't need keys but keys come in handy it allows you to play the game uh, if you do have a WUD file most of them are those are the ones that work most of the time but you need the keys to have it work sometimes it doesn't work even with some games that don't require a key so it's good to have the keys available so that you can play the game just in case it doesn't work so here's an example of what the key should look like you should have a common key and then you put the key that you put the key of your desired game within to the window here just type it in, type it out there and then you can put a hashtag or whatever it is on the side just just so that you can keep track of whatever the title may be so you know what key it is in this example you can see how I have mine set up if you want this particular file and just for example or you want to use it I'll also leave a link down in the description for this particular keynote and there's some game keys already in there feel free to take that and use that for the games that are on that list as you can see there's not many but you have that at least just in case you can't find those games on uh, the key list so secondly while we're on the topic of keys you're going to need keys so you're going to go over to this website right here and this has a bunch of Wii U title keys I had a better key list than this a long time ago but I have no idea where it is I barely use the CMU emulator anymore and I think I was cleaning out my computer and cleared out some files but these keys will do these work um, there's other places you can get more keys I would have given you guys that other information but I no longer have it but um, this is one of the places where you can get Wii U title keys so you can play your Wii U games so there's that okay now once you set up your CMU emulator you have all of the necessary 
files, you set up the keys. If you want to use my key list, if you just take that key out and then copy and replace it with the key text that I already have down there left for you, you can do that too. It'll be a lot easier. Just replace it. And then you can just add more keys later. It's a lot easier to just replace. So just replace it with that and then you're all set. So the, the last thing, finally, but not least, you're gonna need a, a game to play. So there's places where you can go to get Wii U games and you can find it just by going on Google and typing Wii U ROMs or something like that and you can find it. But um, I've left two games for you to download down in the description to get you started and also test out your Wii U emulator so I've added that so you already have two games you can choose from they're pretty much identical but one is Mario one is Luigi but yeah I've left that down in the description for you guys so no sweat trying to get a game for the time being but if you want other games other than these you will have to go and find your own and look on the internet you can find it so you shouldn't have a problem finding it so you want to then open the game that you want to run you know click up and open and locate wherever you may have saved your game once you've downloaded it and then start it And as you can see, it's running and it works. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. I hope it was helpful for you guys. Make sure to leave a like and share and subscribe. And also make sure to share this with your friends. Also, if you guys have any questions, leave your thoughts down below. I will be sure to help you out with anything you have questions with or questions for uh, this particular tutorial. I'll help you out where I can. But anyways, but anyways, guys, until next time, this has been K7. Peace. Later.